Hi everybody, Ray from 28 Left Productions. Today, we're gonna look over the uh, Mega Bulldog. This blaster, I kinda got in a very uh, unique sort of way. I got this for like 50 cents. I'm not kidding. Uh, I literally found $20 outside on the ground went into my local Walmart and bought this thing. And after tax, I had to pay like 50 cents for it. So, yay. Um, okay, so this blaster, uh, it's tiny. It's incredibly tiny. Here's a uh, Cyclone Shock. They're, it's just a hair bigger than that in the deployed state. And uh, they're about the same size in uh, uh, when it's compacted here. Um, so basically this is a oh, single shot top prime blaster with the smart AR system. So no matter which uh, one you load in, that's the uh, it will fire. Uh, so you don't have to worry about uh, uh, loading the dart wherever you put it. So you can do that, and the top one should still fire. Yep. And now the bottom one. Yep. Comes with extra storage on the side, which I haven't had any issues with on this one. Uh, this site. This site is worthless um it looks cool uh but functional uh the functionality of it nah i mean yeah look Ooh, it does does a thing but whatever uh okay so advantages of this particular blaster well it's a front loader so that means it's easy to load also only has a three shot capacity so you don't have to worry about loading a lot uh, so if you have a dump pouch, uh, you can just throw three darts in here uh, fairly quickly and you're good to go. Um, ergonomics. It's, it's a little weird. The, the, the primary grip is okay. Uh, I don't like these little lanyard things on the bottom. Uh, though this lanyard one is way more useful than this one back here. Because if you have this in the deployed state and you put your lanyard on here it's not the it doesn't stay compact because wish it would uh, stay in the uh, locked position but it does not um, but anyway oh yeah and it's this little button right here is what you gotta push to uh, collapse it and you don't have to push it again to open it. All you have to do is either pull the stock, this uh, forward handle, or, oh no, it doesn't actually open. Okay, well, okay, so handle or the stock. Um, okay, so why have the Bulldog? Well, if you have certain game types where Mega Rounds do, um, special things like maybe they defeat shields uh armor piercing uh rounds generally speaking that's what the uh megas are for now would i use the bulldog over say the uh, cyclone shock probably not um the cyclone shock to me uh with the larger ammo capacity is a little bit more useful uh than the bulldog uh, but the Bulldog is, actually it's lighter. Now, not that it's lighter, it's it's just better balanced. Uh, yeah, because like all the weight on the Cyclone Shock is forward. This one's got some weight behind it, so it's actually the center of gravity on it. It's a little bit, yeah, it's a little bit front heavy, but it's not much. Um, this is very, it's like all front heavy. Um, 
So as a secondary, uh, if you need Megas for a particular game, then I would say, yeah, the Bulldog is not bad. Um, probably not my first choice. First choice would probably be the Cyclone Shock, but um, yeah, not bad. Now, if I was gonna say a primary, uh, Bulldog is probably not it. Neither is a Cyclone Shock. Honestly, I would probably go with the Twin Shock, uh, only because your ammo capacity is significantly higher and you get two at once or with a really slow trigger pull. Well, I'm not doing, there you go. You can actually get one shot off at a time uh, depending on trigger control. That and your hands are on all of the uh, necessary controls at all times with this one. Um, with the Bulldog, this front grip is not the priming grip. This is not how you prime the blaster. You still gotta go up here. Uh, I don't like moving your hand uh, if you don't have to. Um, now, if you're not trying to use this as a really, really small like SMG style thing, but just trying to pistol it, it's not so bad, uh, which is probably how I would run it, uh, more so than the, because this stock is ridiculous. I mean, I am so cramped. It's, yeah, no, not gonna happen. Um, but generally speaking, as a secondary uh, or as a sidearm, this would be okay. Uh, I would probably run it as a lanyard coming off of here, uh, not here. I don't even know why that's there because that's dumb. Um, Well, let's leave it off, uh, leave it open the entire time, then maybe not so bad. If that's the case, I'd probably want to remove this sight thing. Um, that way it's... Honestly, I'm probably just going to remove it anyway. I don't kind of don't like it. But anyway, this is the Nerf uh, Mega Bulldog. Over here is a video YouTube thinks you should watch. Why? I don't know. They just think you should watch it. And over here is a video that... I'll add and post. I'm Ray with 2A Left Productions, and I'll see y'all later.